Hello everybody, welcome back to Ghosts of Tsushima. Um, last time, we pretty much wiped the uh, map clean of almost every Mongol outpost. We just have Izumi Village and Fort Izumi left. Um, All right, Kalad. Good luck on your exams. Thank you for the look. But we don't have any side tails. So all we have left is to do the main story. So we'll begin Wolves at the Gates. You know, have I and I have secured the staging camp at Jokaku Temple. But the path sent to Toyotama are blocked, and will need reinforcements if we're going to take the fight to the Khan. I should speak with Yuna at Chokaku Temple to plan our next attack. <laughs> More blood for the blood kamis. Yes. We will definitely be needing that. But, uh, first things first, we'll to fast travel here. And begin... Well, grab the gift altar and then we can talk to Yuna, finally. Just gotta find the gift altar. Oh, there it is. Jim, over here. Hello. We could use the old road from Omi up through Fort Kaminodake. Only problem is it's held by Mongols. We need help to drive them out. I know some hunters camped on Mount Sago. Their leader's named Takashi. Friend of yours? No, but he'll do anything I ask. <laughs> These men are good archers. While you're meeting them, I'll slip through your uncle's castle. Meet our friends in Omi. Lead them to strike the fort from the south. I'll attack from the north with your hunter friends. Think it'll work? Yes. It has to. Be careful, you know. You too. All right. Find Takashi's camp in the Stago Prefecture. Which is here. So, we'll fast travel to Shrine and head over. Okay. Ah, just now got the notification. I went live. Only five minutes in. It's actually better than usual. Uh, Twitch shenanigans. They're always a delight. <laughs> Hello, Sovereign. Welcome. We're uh, on our way to find... Takashi's camp in the Sago Prefecture. This is where Yuna told us to go to find potential allies. And when Jin asks, are they your friends? She says, no. But they'll do anything I ask. So, this will be interesting. No, you're standing pretty close to the target. I don't think you're getting a good, uh, um, abilities to judge your marksmanship there. You're welcome at our campfire, my lord. I'm sensing a butt. You know my name? 
I'm Jin Sakai. You know something. She's alive? Where is she? The Mongols blocked the pass to Omi. I have to open the way and I can't do it alone. Yuna told me you can help. <laughs> Sounds dangerous. I thought you were an expert hunter. Leader of the best archers in the prefecture. Is that what Yuna told you? She thinks you care enough to fight. Is she wrong? About me? No. But my people need a reason to risk their lives. It's going to be a cold winter. Why spend it on a mountainside hunting squirrel when you can live in a warm fort? If we can stay till spring, we're in. <laughs> you have a deal. It's going to be like hunting wild boar. Come over here and you'll see. Mongol archers guard the gate. Patrols ride in and out all day. If we can get in from this side, Yuna and the rest of my friends will hit them from the south. Yuna will be there? All right. The fort was built around the cliffs. We can use them to get inside. Woodcutter camp. Supplied lumber to the fort. Haven't seen anyone there since the Mongols showed up. How good are you at climbing? Better than average. <laughs> Way to be humble. Although I'm kind of worried about how interested Takashi is in Yuna. It's making me a little nervous. Alright, travel to Fort Kamadogat. Gee, whatever. Um. Fast travel there. And I remember when I got to the fort while I was opening the fog of war, those Mongols there were, were pretty accurate with their arrows. This could be interesting. I had to turn tail and run. Grab poison dart. Never know when you'll need it. Back away from the edge. I'll be right up. Sure you Alright, um... I see now. Did you see that? Yuna's got some interesting friends. Let's plan our attack. You can see inside from over here. Archers on that ridge will have a good view of the courtyard. And plenty of targets. The bulk of our force should go there. We'll get on that roof. Control the high ground. <laughs> you sound like you. She was a good teacher. <laughs> Alright, take care. Everyone else, get to the ridge. Take care of the archers. And then... Take the rooftops. Always take out the ranged or the rangers first. They will make your life hell. Uh, 
Hey, I was gonna do that, you kill-stealing thief. I mean, I guess they're bandits, so... Okay, is there anybody underneath uh, us in the building? No. <laughs> okay, I do have some hallucinations, so let's cause some mayhem. Oh, okay. There we go! <laughs> Those guys are fucking around with each other. Um, you do as well. <laughs> hello, Raz. Uh, hello, Nicholas. I think everybody's dead. Well, well done, everybody. Well done. Just gotta watch out for the inevitable double cross. Or am I being paranoid again? What's up? How's it going? Y y you okay? Alright. Good talk. It's always important to loot the dead.
think that should about do it. So yeah, let's talk. What sort he's dead. And he's inverted. The woodcutters must have resisted them. Let's kill every bastard in this fort. Another patrol. We'll ambush them when they come through. Hide. You heard him. Move. Open fire on my signal. Ah, oh, fuck hiding. I'm the ghost. I got ghost stance. I'll be fine. Then get close now. Kill them all. What's up? Fight to the pain. I heard Lord Shimura has come. Put the samurai on your shoulder. Why aren't you leaving them? Lord Shimura has his plan to fight the Mongols. And I have mine. You're on your own. This fort isn't yours to give us. The Jito is at his castle. He'll have no need of this place until spring. We'll be gone before he shows up. Jin isn't really good at lying, so that's why I didn't lie. You know, she did that. We have to get over there. Let's get a look at the bridge. Ow! Meant to do that. charge across the bridge. We'll have to deal with that Huacha quickly. Could you sneak under the bridge with that hook of yours? Take the Huacha by surprise? I could try. I could grapple onto the tree and swing across. There's a way up the cliff on the other side. If they spot you, we can hit them with arrows. Charge across or sneak over. Either way, it'll be risky. We'll follow your lead, Lord Sakai. Get your people ready to move. I know the samurai way would be to charge across, but that Huacha will annihilate us, so we need to do the sneaky way. All right, let's see how low we can get. Oh, here we go. Bye bye. <laughs> Enjoy rockets. Reinforcements on the way. Friends at the gate. 
All right. Oh, hello. Bye bye. There they are. They brought some friends from Yariko. Look at it out. You're the ghost, but you're supposed to be ten feet tall. Southern friends are here. At least the ones that believe in me. Scammer dead. Never better. All things considered. Good to see you, Lord Sakai. Uh, um, is it this cold everywhere up here? Yes. You'll get used to it. Take any supplies we need and prepare to ride for Jogoku. So, you and Takeshi. That was my old life. He and his people are more than hunters, aren't they? Depends on how you look at it. I told them they can stay and hold the pass for us. But I don't want bandits making trouble for innocent people fleeing the Mongols. He knows what I'd do to him if they tried. I think he's been looking forward to seeing you. He's seen me. We can go now. <laughs> Let's get everyone to Jokoku. We'll plan our final attack from there. It's time for the Khan to die. Wolves at the gates. Reunite with your allies. Complete. Four tales updated. Huh. Ah, here we go. Let's go ahead and do this one because that's the last of those. And we can access the south because we have a pass. So let's go ahead and check out the dye merchants. And oh, yeah, I have a. I have saddles. services no but you might be able to help me there we go excellent choice thank you I look forward to hearing I 
I see you found banners. Yeah. I must confess, the emblem of Clan Kikuchi is a strange one to me. It symbolizes the mighty winter lords. They say Kikuchi's warriors took comfort from the cold and dark of Kamiagata. They also say living there made them harsh and stubborn. At clan gatherings, they usually kept to themselves. When they didn't, there was often a quarrel that ended in a duel. <laughs> and the call went out to gather at Komoda. Lord Kikuchi and his men didn't hesitate to join us. I admire your honesty, my lord. It's important to remember that even samurai are flesh and blood. Yep. Samurai are human too. They are not perfect, as we have already seen. Um, let's go ahead and take care of this. Um, yes! But most nobles are, in some form or fashion. That just usually when people believe themselves to be better than others, um, whether warranted or not, there's often the temptation to, um, I don't want to put it. Um, see others as beneath you. Yeah. I I honestly believe that Jin is one of the few samurai who don't see the peasants below him as less than human. They are his, it's his duty to protect them, not because, you know, they work the fields and shit, but that is a samurai's duty. You protect those who can't protect themselves. He believes in the ideal of the samurai, but uh, he's learned throughout this game that uh, that's not always the uh, night's duty. Not okay. Well, I think Jin's taken that as his own personal duty. Then, hello, Nugget. We uh, opened up the south, so we can actually finish some things up that we couldn't before. Yeah. Like this last lighthouse. Sago Lighthouse. Now, to... <laughs> you're also playing a traditional Japanese legend, Yakuza Zero. Yeah, that's totally a Japanese legend. Okay. 
Okay. A sister betrayed. I've never played the Yakuza games, so I, I couldn't, I wouldn't know. Oh, hello. I'm sorry to interrupt. Why not? You've been praying. To my ancestors. Asking forgiveness for what I'm about to do. What do they say? I can't hear them. Perhaps your ancestors are silent. Because they can't do what you must. I know where my sister is. Clan Kikuchi's old fault. Then you're ready? I have no incense left to burn. No more prayers to make. What do you do when one member of your family turns on the rest? The Kikuchi estate is this way. How did you find your sister? She was married to a man named Ikeda, a retainer for Clan Kikuchi. Their stronghold is near here, under the mountain. She always wanted an estate and holdings of her own. Uh, with Kikuchi's men fallen at Komoda. It made sense she would try and take Kikuchi's for herself. Especially after she failed to take yours. I asked around. It seems a new clan has taken up residence. Their emblem matches the one on the notes. Then it's her. A new clan, huh? into a haven for refugees. Claiming she knows what it's like to lose her home. Do you think it's true? We're about to find out. Why would your sister say she lost her home? She had to leave home when she married Ikeda. You said Ikeda was a retainer? Yes. But you're the younger sister. Why were you the one to marry a samurai? When we were young, bandits attacked our estate. Hana hid with our parents. I took up a sword. Only I would do it. Dispatch the bandits to the samurai guard arrive to help. Adachi was leading them. Hana saw him as a way to realize her ambitions, but he only had eyes for me. <laughs> she was jealous then, the seed of many betrayals. I wanted to ease her heartbreak, so I helped arrange her marriage to Ikeda, and she was sent north. Did you know the man you sent your sister to live with? Ikeda was a respected widower. People spoke well of his kindness. Kindness is a mask, easily removed behind closed doors. What are you getting at, Jane? I want to understand why she went to such extremes to destroy you. After so many years. There is only one thing to understand. Hana murdered my family. And today, she will pay for it. I don't think I'll be able to stop Masako or Makato from killing Hana, but I'd at least like to know it's justified. I mean, the amount of blood on her hands already does kind of tip the scales that way, but there are such things as mitigating circumstances, although 
They had to be pretty big to justify murdering children. I guess what I'm saying is I just want to know the whole story before she dies. Was there ever any sign of her betrayal? We were never close, but our relationship was always cordial. I would see her at Lord Shimura's conclaves. We'd exchange pleasantries. I had no idea she held such hate in her heart. But she was at your estate, the day of the attack. She came that morning to wait with me for news from Komoda Beach. We were both concerned for our husbands. It was the first time I ever felt close to her. She met my grandchildren, brought them gifts. They loved her. Now I know she hadn't come for comfort, but to witness our death. The women in your family fought. I saw that for myself. I stayed with my son's wives while Hana took the children and ran for the stables. Afterward, I found what I thought was her body. The face was brutalized, unrecognizable. But the gold sash was Hana's. I buried her with my family. She must have learned you survived the attack. Faked her death to escape you. A clever plan. My survival was her greatest mistake. We're almost there. Leave the horses. We'll continue on foot. Okay. Fort Kikuchi. Guards at the gate. Be ready. This is a haven for survivors. There's no telling what to expect. Where's Lady Hana? It's Lady Mother. Kill her! You cut them down! Before more gods show up. Hold on, I have to <laughs> do this properly. Okay, just so I know, if there are refugees here, we don't kill them. So she is helping people. Hana helps no one but herself. Lady Hana, show yourself! You serve a murderer! Face me, you coward! Alright, there's that. How many are there? Doesn't matter. Kill them all! Well, uh, I can say Makoto's definitely in service for the Blood Gods. She's more murderous than me. <laughs> you're in armor and have weapons, therefore you're a threat. Hello, Gio. Where's Lady Hana? In the estate up the hill, my lord. Tell the coward her sister has come. Hello, Fluffy. What will you do when you see her? Exactly what she did to me. She's still your family. My family is dead. She is nothing but a murderer. Just make sure it's only her. She has any children. They're innocent. Don't kill them. I beg of you. Hana, show yourself. Be better than her. Little sister, you let me think I buried you. Who was it, really? 
A peasant woman killed by the Mongols. Did you weep for me? You have taken everything! Daughters and grandchildren. Not nearly enough. The Mongols robbed me of Adachi's death. And you cheated yours. But finally, I will take everything. Kill them. Hey! Stop her. I will deal with them. Thank you. Fire! Where's Masako? I don't have time for this bullshit! And my children, my grandchildren, destroyed my family. A small price to pay for what you've done. I have done nothing. You stole everything. Drove me from our home. Took the life that was rightfully mine. Left me with that abusive drunk in this frozen land. For an eternity of pain to understand the life I've lived. The life you forced on me. None of that is my fault. It is. And damn you for acting as if it isn't. You've come to kill me. So finish this. It will be your only kindness. I can't end your suffering. But you can. Now, you have nothing! To be honest, I'd have been afraid that uh, she would have attacked uh, Lady Makoto. Masako. I've tried to honor them. Meditate on treasured memories. But she consumes them. Even now. I have nothing left. No. You've accomplished what you set out to do. You have honored your family. Given them justice. Now you can find peace. This path does not lead to peace. Where does it lead? I don't know. I have to continue walking it to find out. I don't want you to go. You must. But I will be there. When you need me. The sister betrayed. Remember when you suggest you know, play with TLS until a million relief plan? That was hell. <laughs> well, I, you asked what was the worst possible weapon to use against the uh, the Alicorn and be, and TLS is one of them. So, mission accomplished, I guess. 
All right. So we have completed the tale of Lady Masako. What charm did we get? Charm and Lost Mine. Ooh, that's interesting. Now, on to okay, the Gathering Storm. More Yuna stories. But we still have side quests to do. This time with Sensei Ishikawa. Sakai, you need to talk. When I was your age, people said I was the next Tadayori Nagao. You're the best archer we've ever had. Yeah, not even close. But I'm damn good. <laughs> And I'm grateful for everything you taught me. I was so dedicated to my study. I never made time for a family. Tomoe was to be my heir. Her crimes. I could not forgive her. No, somewhere I would. I devoted my life to the bow. The life it gave me was remarkable. But the life it took from me. Family is more important. Sensei. Don't become like me. Don't let the ghost consume you. Hey. The Moe is somewhere in Kamiagata. A last ditch effort to rally the Mongols and restore her reputation. If she's here, we will find her. And end this. Yes, we will. Hell hydrate. <sighs> so we need to there. There is a haiku place nearby. find up here. Japanese arrows. Lord Shimura's men? I Japanese doubt it. Japanese did this. Likely a group. Unless Sensei Ishikawa has been here. <gasps> Please, excuse me, my lord. Who are you? It's a bad idea to sneak up on me. I thought you were with the man who killed these Mongols. He was samurai, but older. An archer? Sensei Ishikawa. Where is he? He said... 
he come back to my house in a day or two. Why your house? I have food, a fire. Whatever his business was, it seemed urgent. <sighs> it's possible he picked up Tomoe's trail. Where's your house? Not far, but there's a storm coming, and I need to check my snares first. Then I can take you there. Fine, I'll go with you. What's your name? Matsu, my lord. Yeah, I don't trust Matsu. Especially since I don't know what Tomoe really looks like. What exactly did Sensei Ishikawa tell you? Nothing more, my lord. He wasn't the friendliest man. Sounds about right. I never talked to a real samurai. War brings unlikely people together. It's my chance to ask a really good question. Don't mess it up. <laughs> What's it like to hold the power of life and death in your hands? It's a heavy responsibility. But you secretly enjoy it. Only a monster would enjoy it. That's not the answer I expected. It's a duty I must perform. There! One of my snares. Check it quickly. I don't want to miss Ishikawa. To reset it. You might have more luck hunting. Oh, I could never do that. It's so awful. Maybe try a different bait. My bait never changes. What do you use? The illusion of opportunity. There's your problem. That only works on men. <laughs> this way, my lord. It's not easy surviving up here. Yeah, this, this, uh... I fled north when the Mongols came. Alone? My parents died when I was a girl. Been on my own ever since. Your family must be very important. My uncle is Lord Shimura. Wait. You're the one people talk about. The ghost. But you're not ten feet tall with eyes like a demon. <laughs> no. But the stories frighten the enemy. So that's it. It's just rumors and exaggeration? <sighs> to fight them, I've had to do things I would have frowned on before. We all have. I don't like this. Don't hurt us, my lord. That's not yours. We are sorry. It's just a squirrel. We have eaten grass and tree bark for days. I'm, I'm figuring it's a it trap. Go. Thank you, my lord. You let them escape. We thought dinner. They were starving. And no threat. Doesn't sound like the ghost I've heard about. Not all the stories about me are true. The blizzard is almost on us. How many more traps do you have? Just one. But it's farther away. Get back here, horse. No one will believe I talked to you. What's it like to be the ghost? The stories are stories. Without allies and friends, I'd be dead. You're just saying that. I owe my life to many others, from the Lady of Clan Adachi to a thief. People may not tell their stories, but I would not be here without them. We should get back soon. I don't want to miss Sensei Ishikawa. The last trap is just a little farther, my lord. <laughs> the trap is for me, isn't it? Here we are. 
out in the middle of nowhere. Look at this! Dinner! You got something? We might eat like civilized people after all. What's up there? The mainland. No Mongols, no war. Somewhere I can start over. Say you make it to the mainland. What then? In Kyoto. I'll open a fancy inn. Learn to play the shamisen. Welcome the undying parade of beautiful men and women. While my servants rub them blind. Sounds like Kyoto's in trouble. Snowing harder. We should go. Maybe your sensei will be waiting for us. <laughs> the weather's getting worse. Stay close. If I get any closer, we'll have to share a horse. What was that? Never mind. Keep going. Hangman. I don't like this. I'm naturally paranoid, you know this. My lord, Mongols, close to the house. I'll deal with them. Stay back. Where's your house? Not far. Come on. Where's my horse? Get back here. Here we are. Let's get inside. I don't know. It, it, everything about her just seems seem off. To, to be the ghost. But the way you kill those Mongols... I do what I have to for Tsushima. The truth is, we're both survivors. We have darkness in us. If we didn't, we'd be dead. I honestly think she's Tomoe. Similar. But it sounds more natural coming from you. Tomoe. Ishikawa always said I underestimate my opponents. I don't have an arrow in my back. Why not? The Mongols turned against me. After you trained them to slaughter our people. A mistake I tried to fix. But I can't kill all my archers. Not at all. You need me, and the Sensei, but we don't need you. I know where they'll attack next. We can ambush them together. You get the victory, I get revenge. I'll talk it over with Sensei Shikawa. Jin, you can stay the night. No, Tomoe, I can't. <laughs> I already have Yuna. I knew she was probably Tomoe. Just the way she acted and the way she spoke. But I th I do think she's genuine and wanting out. 
I don't know if it's atonement, but I think she's done and wants to leave. Roll your blades. Damn it. Well, that was fun. Yeah, hydrate. I'm gonna need more incendiary oil. I'm not in combat anymore, so let's just uh, do, 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 fast travel. <laughs> what did I drink? Um, wouldn't you like to know? Let's just say that uh, I do love me some fire. My lord. Sakai. Sakai, you have news? Something like that. I spoke with Tomoe. She's hiding in the north. The Mongols turned against her. If you saw her, why is Fire she still alive? Her archers are preparing a massive attack. She wants the three of us to wipe them out. Or she needs both our heads to get back in the Mongols' favor. She could have killed me, Sensei, but she didn't. Hmm. I have never been rewarded for trusting Tomoe. I don't trust her. But we need what she knows. And I believe she needs our help. Then she's a fool. And we finish this. <sighs> All right. The final story in the tale of Sensei Ishikawa and Tomoe laid to rest. The Mongol archers Tomoe trained are planning a surprise attack somewhere. Tomoe has enlisted Sensei Ishikawa and I to help her stop them. 
I'm not sure I trust her, but this could be our chance to end the destruction she and her Mongol allies have caused. And we got a new half bow die. Excuse me while I figure out how to do this. Huh. Not bad. <laughs> I'm never doing inverted controls unless it's flying. <laughs> because it will be however long, even if it's only for a limited time, however long it will be, it will be me just running around in circles, staring up and then down, trying to figure out where the hell I'm going. That will get old really fucking quick. And I might start throwing controllers. Where the hell is laid to rest? Nope, not doing it. Ah, here we are. There's content and then there's torture. I don't do torture. Y'all tried it the last time with that Scarface challenge. That ended up being torture. You can boo all you like, but that... Them's the brakes. As uh, I, I, fair enough. Sovereign is excluded from the y'all because she actively was telling me to uh, say screw the challenge and just play the game. <laughs> Word from Tomoya. The three of us will meet. Then she'll reveal where and when her archers plan to attack. You think she'll tell us the truth? We'll find out. And Sakai, there will be no room for error. I came prepared, Sensei. Let's go. Laid to rest. Where are we headed? North of Floof, whatever gets your motor running, that's your like that's your thing. For an ambush. We have the advantage. The Mongols turned against her. She is desperate. Desperate enemies are dangerous. Because they are unpredictable. But Tomoe has two choices. Enlist our help or betray us. You spent time with her. What do you think? <laughs> she didn't attack me in Jogaku. That could be a trick to lower your guard. We're prepared for treachery. If she doesn't ambush us, we hear her out. And if this planned attack is real, we cooperate. After that, we'll deal with her. She betrayed her people. She will answer for it. Sorry, I saw flowers. What will you say when you see her? I have nothing to say to Tomoe. You don't want answers? You haven't spoken since she joined the enemy. Any chance of talking ended the moment she turned on me. We're getting close. Eyes open. We go on foot from here. Stay low. 
places to hide archers here. I know, I, uh, got ambushed here. You did what? I was trying to help out a, uh, That's the gambling a sake no Mongols that we can see. Stop here. That outcropping to the right. I'll position myself there. And you... If I was here to kill you, you'd already be dead. Damn. <laughs> She's good. We should wait out here. Not a chance. Stay alert. Are we having an emote war? There will be no survivors. <laughs> So sure of yourself. The one thing you never had to teach me. Your archers are planning an attack. Where and when? Umugi Cove. <laughs> Heading there now. Why tell us? The Khan betrayed me. I'm taking my archers away. And if we don't help you stop them, they'll wipe out Umugi Cove. I don't believe you. Do nothing. And watch what happens. <laughs> The Mongols followed me. Well, that sounds like Mongols, so let's uh, kill the Mongols. Would you quit fighting and start killing the Mongols? Jesus! Why is it that I'm the only one that's actually doing their job? He got poisoned. No more traps to Malay. This wasn't a trap. She fought back against the Mongols, Sensei. To deceive us, so we lower our guard. If I want to put an arrow in you, there's nothing you can do to stop me. Enough. Umugi Cove could be under attack. We need to move. Fine. But if Tomoe even breathes wrong, I'll put her in the dirt. Fine. Great. Don't okay. care. This way. We gotta protect <laughs> the Ronin Den. Let's go. That's interesting. Mongol patrol. Well, we're definitely getting more of her side of the story. And quite frankly, I'm content with exiling her off the island. What's the best route to the coast? <laughs> if they see us headed for Umugi Cove, Tomoe's archers could be alerted. Agreed. We should stay off the roads. Cut through this field. How did you find my camp in that You people attacked me. I told them to avoid you two. I had plans for a dozen more camps. I'm glad they ignored your orders. I lost control. By the time we set up in Kushi, I wasn't in charge. 
more ahead. A lot more. Take it. Burn the flowers. Well, it's a little late for that. You said you lost control of the Mongols in Kushi. But a woman saw you there with them. A woman you burned alive. That was not my doing. Not with your bow, but you trained her killers. Most of the time, I convinced them to spare lives, not take them. Okay, my stance on this is at Best, Tomoy is guilty of negligence and treason, but there's mitigating circumstances. I'm mentioning it now. Wait here until nightfall. We can use the darkness to our advantage. Will they attack the cove before then? No. They'll position archers. Make sure no one gets out. Plan their slaughter. Get some rest. I'll keep watch. So I would recommend. Exile from the island to the mainland. Sun's down. Ready? Tomoe, you're in front. The sensor and I will follow. So you can stab me in the back? If the Mongols spot you first, we get out of sight and drop them. Let's go. Stay close. Don't let her out of your sight, Sakai. I can hear you, sensor. Good. <laughs> Mongol lookouts ahead. Jing, you take one. I'll take the other. More on the way. Hide yourselves. Excuse you. Tagoro, not dead. O sudden, in the sonor serem steba. On your mark, Sakai. Don't miss, Sensei. Falcon shot, Sensei. We saw that. Form two. I shift the right hand down. So when you release. Hmm. That's interesting. Oh, I guess I can't end his suffering. <laughs> For no apparent reason whatsoever, I'm going to save the game. For no reason whatsoever. 
Hello, Phoenix. Yes, I did. I just hadn't had a chance to do anything about it yet. That didn't work. <laughs> All right. Let's try this way. Uh-huh, sure, not bragging, huh? I trust her desire for revenge. So that's how she stayed one step ahead of us. You taught her well, Sensei. I know. Get ready. Now! Twice in the same fight. Not bad, Sakai. Where's Tomoe? I don't know. Was she wounded? Tomoe! Near the end of the fight, I saw her by the archway over there. That leads straight into Umugi Cove. 
If any Mongols try to retreat that way, maybe she gave chase. It must be a perfect opportunity for her to flee and hide. Her killing her archers won't erase her crimes. But she got her revenge. Is that all she got? She fought alongside us. That will mean something once we defeat the enemy. Forget the Mongols. What does she want in Umugi Cove? There's not much here besides thieves and cutthroats. Damn it, and smugglers. <laughs> a boat to get off the island. I... I'm really tempted to... Let her get off the island. Did you see a woman run through here? A warrior. She was headed for the beach. This way! Ishikawa will probably be pissed, but... She helped save Umugi Cove. The Mongols were hunting her. We gave her safe passage to a way off the island. We're always one step behind. But there's still time to stop her. Sensei Ishikawa, we have judged each other harshly, but the Buddha tells us that our greatest enemies can be our best teachers. I am grateful for your teaching and for the chance to fight by your side. A final time, I have been your student. I would have become your daughter, but the way of the bow is behind me now. What lies ahead? I am like an arrow shot from a bow. Who knows where the wind will take me? It's over. Maybe she'll reach Kyoto after all. If she were anyone else, I'd say that's impossible. We still have a war to finish, a home to rebuild. I have no more lessons to give in this life, except one. Promise me, you won't repeat my mistakes. I promise, Sensei. Okay. Tomoe was able to get, get off the island. Shattered Mask of Tomoe, worn by a legendary archer, once an enemy, but no longer. Tomoe could have become a great samurai. She broke her bow. She really did give it up. <coughs> Excuse me. Let's check out this uh, new... Bow die. Extra life. She learned the final lesson Ishikawa could teach her, and that is to let go. Not or not be afraid to let go of the old life. Ooh, that's nice. All right. I think we got time for one more story. 
Norio has returned to Kamigata to save his home temple for the Mongols. I should join him there. I'm really glad we didn't have to kill Timoy. <laughs> now she can atone. Face me! So fast. What the fuck is going on? Hurt you. you were praising the Mongols. Do they pay well for your services? If they refuse, they kill us. <laughs> but the Guardian's brother will change that. What do you know about Norio? He's going to lead us to victory. I can take you to him. The Guardian of Tsushima. Norio know you're helping the Mongols? Until we take back Sida Temple, he told us to keep cooperating, so they don't suspect us. That doesn't sound like Norio. Ah. Really? But you inspire everything he does. He always talks about what he learned from the ghost. What are you doing back here? I brought the ghost! I mean, cooperating with an enemy while silently sabotaging them. That is completely okay in my book. It's a form of resisting. Use the tree line as cover. Lord Sakai. Everyone, give me a moment to speak with Lord Sakai. Jeez, look at those Naginatas. I hear you're planning to take back Cedar Temple. We've been training hard. They're ready. I recognize some faces here. From Akashima. I sent messengers to Kushi Temple, but no one came. After all we did there, we can free Cedar Temple without them. Are we going to jump in the river, or...? You think these people can take back the temple? We can handle it on our own. Why risk their lives? Cedar Temple can be a beacon for all of Tsushima. Everyone who takes part in the attack will be a messenger of hope. We can't carry this message alone. This victory has to be theirs. When do we ride, Norio? We ride for Cedar Temple with the ghosts. When you took Castle Canada, 
you did it without the samurai, you must have had doubts going in. I wasn't sure we could take Kaneda until it was done. I feel the same about my brother and his men by my side. I wish Excuse Kendo me. Was here with us. His spirit is. Bravery is not having no fear. Or not having any fear. Bravery is having fear, but still doing what needs to be done in spite of it. I mean, yeah, if you're a commander, you don't want anyone to know that you're afraid, but if you're just a, like a you have support us, no grunt, they remember the it's okay. And they know why we ride for Sita Temple. They're fortunate you fight for them. We should get off the road. This way. The temple is just ahead, through the cedars. Are they holding any monks hostage? No. One reason I told them to cooperate, reduce their risk when we attack. Good thinking. Norio's learned well. We're getting close. Breathe, Norio. You can't fight if you hold your breath. <laughs> How could you tell? I know you well enough by now, my friend. Norio, and the ghost. We came as soon as we could. It's good to have Kushi Temple with us. Cedar Temple, Akashima, and Kushi stand together as one. We'll attack through the main gate? Yes. Draw the Mongols' attention while the others flank. What do you want me? My lord, this may be my plan, but you should fight as you see fit. All of you, follow me. Stay close. Defeat the Mongols and take back the temple. Not one of you will die today. Everyone who falls will live forever in history. There's two up there. They have a watcher. Gotta take out that watcher. that watcher it's not up there Behind you. <laughs> it's 
Stop! Tell me, can a Mongol like you show fear? Was yours. Huh, <sighs> that was fun. time I was here, my brother, Hochi, the abbot, they were all alive. You study today, you can rebuild. Come with me to the main hall. <laughs> that is why you never miss the blankets. This way, my brother. Huh. <sighs> Your cat no, pumpkin you. approves. Lord Sakai. Good. What's wrong? Do not go inside the main hall. Get a hold of yourself. Whatever the Mongols destroyed, we can rebuild. The hall looks fine from the outside. Uh nothing damaged or stolen. Ooh. And he took you out of the pit. I thought. Long must promise to stay. If I told them everything. And he and Joe. It's all right now. I told them. Doesn't matter. Oh, I, I held on to see you. But I can't live like this. Yes, you can. Sakai, would you leave us? Yes. Well, that was heavy.
His name is Karcho, the one who burned my brother and cut off his limbs. This Harcho is among the dead. Not yet. <laughs> Ario, your brother was the guardian. He died a hero. No, he didn't. I can find out where this Mongol coward is. But then I'll need your help. You'll have it. When the snow lets up, we'll hold the funeral. Guardian of Tsushima. Threefold world. We have funeral rites. For Injo the Guardian, Noria's older brother. I should see how Noria is doing. Got about ten minutes before we hit two hours. But I think I can afford to do one more story for today. My lord, can I help you? I'm looking for Norio. Where is he? He brought his brother's ashes to a cemetery. It's in the hills to the south. I'll look for him there. Thank you. Cemetery in Saigo. This game so much. I <laughs> I really don't want to stop playing at the end of each stream. the open air better than the pagoda at Caesar <coughs> Temple. The Mongol you're looking for, Harcho, have you found him? He's not far from here. Norio, Sira Temple needs your leadership. This comes first. Revenge is not the first duty of a monk. Before I was a monk, I was a brother. Don't do this alone. Let me help. If you wish. Just don't die. <laughs> we need you alive. For to show you, you're sure he's the one responsible. When I find him, he will pray for a quick death, and his cries will go unheard. Ashish, uh, your angel's brother. Oh, I shit. respect your right to seek revenge. I don't want you to become like what? 
You, like so many others who have been changed by this war, it's far too late for that, my lord. I forgot, I didn't see the other thing. I was looking at chat. Hopefully I didn't uh, end up killing him. I put everything you taught me to good use tracking Khashio. What does he look like? Like every other murdering, honorless Mongol dog. You may only get one chance at him. I'll know him when I see him. When you have him in your sights, strike without delay. Dogs, get away from there! Nurio! Please! We were just hungry! Spare us! We're leaving! Nurio... They weren't a threat. Maybe... They're definitely not now. They should have known better. Dude! Chill! <laughs> Advance... And reach Nirvana. Retreat... And find hell. What's that from? Prayer Enjo inscribed on this Naginata after he saved Kushi Temple from bandits and became the guardian. He suffered more than either of us know, but he held on so he could see you. Do you know what his last words to me were? I was wrong. About what? I'll never know. Karsho's last words will be a howl of pain. <laughs> I should get some rest, Lurio. For tomorrow. You're right, my lord. I'll save my strength for Karsho. I'm gonna guess he went ahead without me. Nurio. Where is he? Damn you, Nurio. The fort is in flames. What did Nurio do? My lord! Please help! He, he's gone mad! Of course he has. Nurio. At first, when I saw him, I thought my prayers were answered, but... Return to see the temple. I'll handle this. This is why revenge is best served cold! <laughs> Seek refuge in the Amida Buddha. Who did this? Norio. He's lost his mind. have the courage to do it. Burn! Burn for your crimes, butcher! You once told me you would never swing your Naginata in hatred. I did what the ghost would do. And now Harsha is gone. I don't swing my sword in hatred. Not after this. Where will you go? It doesn't matter. He was still alive when I lit the wood. When he screamed, it filled me with joy. And I would do it again. I'm no longer a monk. You don't get to give up. We all have regrets and broken promises. But this island needs you. The last warrior monk of Cedar Temple. I can't go back to what I was before this. I'm not asking you to go back. I'm asking you to keep your faith and move forward. 
You think I can go back to being a samurai? Hell no. Chaos headband. <laughs> Fucks. Oh boy. Rena here. Oh, from Ace 3? Okay. Never actually played Ace 3. That is one interpretation, although I'm willing to bet that AC3 is going to be retconned in some form or fashion. You made your choice, now you must live with the results. Yeah. Learn from your mistakes. And move forward. All right. Um, we're gonna go ahead and end with uh, the haiku for hope. Refusing to fail. Overcome the odds. Headband of hope. All right, both Floof and uh, Nugget redeemed. Guide the raid, Psycho Samurai. Um, so we'll go ahead and get that set up. But first, um, let's look out over the ocean. Um, first, tomorrow, um, Floof and I will be uh, starting the Tiny Tina's Assault on Dragon's Keep. Um, uh, DLC from Borderlands 2. <laughs> um, then I'm off Thursday, Friday. It, from all indication, it seems like the Ace Combat 7 DLC will drop sometime before Friday. Not sure when, if it's going to be today, tomorrow, Thursday, whatever. But it sounds like it will happen this week. So as such, I have rescheduled the A6 um, cockpit challenge stream, put it on a hiatus. Friday will be the Ace, uh, the, the experimental A, 
aircraft series showcase. Um, if it turns out that we were all wrong, then we'll go back to Ace Combat 6. It already dropped, really? Or are you messing with me, Floof? I... I don't know. I haven't... I haven't been able to keep a track of anything. Um... But as such... Or anyway, what are we talking? The new Ace Combat 7 DLC, Floof. But anyway... Um... Thursday... We are going to be farming XP for Mass Effect 2. Um, and then Monday, we continue the Dead War uh, with Brass and Floof. And next week in Ghost of Tsushima. <coughs> Excuse me. Sorry. We will. Plan the attack on the Khan stronghold. Um, raid message will be as soon as my uh, thing loads up. There's your raid message. And now let's set up this raid. In any case, thank you all for joining me. Um, we'll go ahead and raid Psycho Samurai. And it looks like he is playing XCOM Enemy Unknown. Interesting. Um, so I feel free to use that raid message if you wish. If not, uh, say whatever you want. Um, thank you all for joining me, and I hope to see you all tomorrow with Bunkers and Badasses. Have a good one. <laughs>